Before beginning chapter 1, we need to know the difference between a 100 square, a 1 to 1000 strip and a 1000 strip. A 100 square has numbers from 1 to 100. To move up, we subtract 10. To move down, we add 10. To move forward, we add 1. And when we want to move back, we subtract 1. A 1 to 1000 strip. A 1 to 1000 strip has numbers that start with 1 and end with 1000. To move up, just like the 100 square, we subtract 10. When we want to move down, we add 10. When we want to move forward, we add 1. And when we want to move back, we subtract 1. A thousand square for the multiples of 10, which is also known as a thousand strip. A thousand square has numbers that start from 10 and end at 1000. When we want to move up, we subtract 100. When we want to move down, we add 100. When we want to go forward, we add 10. And when we want to move back, we subtract 10. Exercise 1.1 Hundreds, tens and ones Here is the last row of a hundred square. Write the numbers in the next row, which is the first row of the 101 to 200 square. We know that when we want to move down in a hundred square, we add 10. When we want to move up, we subtract 10. When we move forward, we have to add 1. And when we want to move back, we subtract 1. To get the answer, you could either add 1 in 101 to get 102 or you could add 10 in 92 to get the same answer. 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109 and 110. Complete these pieces from a 1 to 1000 number strip. Just like the 100 square, when we want to move down in a 1 to 1000 number strip, we have to add 10. When we want to move up, we have to subtract 10. When we want to move ahead, we have to sub add 1. And when we want to move back, we have to subtract 1. Let's write the answers. 102, 122, 111, 113. 201, 211, 221, 222, 122, 142, 131, 133. Draw a representation of 316. How will you show the value of each digit? 300, 110, 6 ones. Now write this number in words. 316. What three digit numbers are being represented below? 200, 4 tens, 2 ones, 242. 500, 1 ten, 3 ones, 513. What is the value of the ring digit in each three digit number? 100, ones, ones, tens, 100, tens. Which hundred values have not been used in these numbers? 500, 600, 700, 800, 900. Write the numbers in the next row of the 1 to 1000 strip. 361, 362, 363, 364, 365, 366, 367, 368, 369 and 370. Draw beads on each abacus to represent the three digit number. Three hundreds, seven tens, five ones, seven hundreds, nine tens, seven ones. Which three digit number is being represented on each abacus? Write each number in words. There is one hundred, five tens, and two ones, 152, 463. Complete these pieces which come from a 1 to 1000 number strip. 510, 520, 
519, 518, 517, 507, 497, 900, 890, 880, 910, 920, 898, 888, 878, 908, 918. Write the missing numbers on each worm. 157, 167, 177. When we add 10 in 177, we get 187, 197, 207, 217, 227, 237, 247, 462, 452, 442, 432, 422, 412, 402, 392, 382, 372, 753, 743, 733, 793, 803, 813, 823. When you have two different digit cards, you can make two different two digit numbers. So when you have three different digit cards, you must be able to make three different three digit numbers. Is Arun correct? How do you know? When you have two different cards, you are able to make two more. But when you have three, you are able to make six. So Arun is not correct. We can make six different cards. Read along each row to find three digit numbers. Read down each column to find another three digit numbers. Write each number in words. 546, 318, 972, 539, 417, 682. Exercise 1.2. Comparing and ordering. Complete these pieces which come from a thousand strip. Let's look at the 1000 square and fill the boxes. The first number is 190. When we subtract 100 from 190, we get 90. When we add 100, we get 290. When we subtract 10, we get 180. And when we add 10, we get 200. Let's fill in the numbers 90, 290, 180, 200. Let's look at 230 now. When we subtract 100, we get 130. When we add 100, we get 330. When we subtract 10, we get 220. And when we add 10, we get 240. 130, 330, 220, 240. 350, 250, 450, 340, 360. Compare these numbers and complete the sentences. An easy way to remember the greater than and less than symbols is to tell the children that the symbols is the mouth of a crocodile and it is always open towards the bigger number to eat the largest meal. 173 is less than 249. 249 is greater than 173. Write the statements in question 2 using the symbols. 173 is less than 249. 249 is greater than 173. Order these numbers from smallest to greatest. 64, 79, 142, 236, 327. Estimate the value of each number marked on the number line. 250, 510, 880. Use the symbols to write two inequalities about these numbers. 256 is less than 465. 465 is greater than 456. Order these numbers from greatest to smallest. 968, 896, 689, 98, 69. Mark the numbers from question 7 on the number line. 69, 98, 689, 
896 and 968. Compare these numbers, write some inequalities using the symbols. 753 is greater than 574. 574 is less than 753. 574 is greater than 547. Yusuf looks at the place value grid in question 9 and writes 547 is less than 753 and 753 is greater than 574. 753 is greater than 547 and 547 is less than 574. Write some more inequalities like those written by Yusuf. 574 is greater than 547 and 547 is less than 753. 547 is less than 574 and 574 is less than 753. What could be the missing digit in each of these inequalities? 634 is less than 641. 765 is greater than 683. 257 is greater than 253. 372 is less than 472. Record all possible solutions to 372 is less than 472, 572, 672, 772, 872 or 972. Order these heights of the towers from shortest to tallest. 442, 452, 462, 555, 632, 828. Write the digits 1 to 9 anywhere in the grid. Read across and down the grid to find three six-digit numbers. Mark each number on the number line. 123, 456, 789, 147, 258 and 369.